Hey, hello again. Welcome to another exciting micro scrapping episode of Guild Skills. Today, I've got a rather unique micro scrapping experience for you. We're going to micro scrap this pet safe wireless pet containment system. I've never taken one of these apart before, but we're going to do it today. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, please hit that subscribe button, like, and throw in a comment for good measure. It would really greatly help out the channel. And you know what? I would appreciate it too. It'd be great to see you around more as well. Talking about you right there. You. All right, so we've got this pet safe wireless pet containment system here. And if your pet had essentially gone outside of this boundary, your pet would get a little bit of a shock and it would basically train your dog, cat, whatever the case may be, to stay within a perimeter, the yard, whatever the case may be. I don't necessarily like these. I don't condone these. And it's going to be a great pleasure to take it apart. So with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and continue. Take this puppy apart. Let's take a look and see what we got here. So at first glance, we've got four screws. So I'm going to take those out and see if we can get this apart. So this is some long screws. Check that out. I'm going to go ahead and start a pile here. Is there anything else? Any other screws? I don't think so. Let's see if we can take this off. Oh my goodness, look at this thing. <laughs> Very interesting indeed. Looks like we got like a small, probably low grade board in here. I'm going to take that out. Got a little bit of a switch here, on off switch, a little bit of metal, otherwise a low grade board. There might be some hidden treasures with some silver in these switches, I'm not really 100% sure. Some of the more experienced scrappers may know, but that is the low grade board, or at least that's what I perceive it to be. Yeah, it goes. All right. This outer casing or front casing is all plastic, so I'm going to set that aside, start a plastic pile. Now. We're going to get to the juicy bit. This thing looks like some sort of like cyclotron or some sort of science experiment. I would anticipate that these probably have copper in them. I'm not 100% sure, but we're gonna find out together. This is probably one of the most interesting micro scrapping things I have ever taken apart. Well, let's go ahead and continue. I'm not even sure where I want to go next here. There's some screws on this board, so I'm going to try to get those off and see if I can get the board removed. See if I can get that board out. Looks like it's still connected via strands of copper here. Let me go ahead and cut those just because I can. See if we can get that board out of there. <laughs> this little cyclotron thing. I don't I, I don't know. It's interesting. Looks like something out of a sci-fi movie. We've got a low grade board. I'm gonna say it's a low grade board. I'm not really 100 percent sure, but I think it's a low grade board. But we've got some nice uh, aluminum here, which is awesome. Pretty cool. I'll let you look at that for a moment. Ooh. Ah yeah. That's the stuff. That's the stuff. Just going to try to organize this as I go here. There we go. We'll put that right up there for now. Now these rings are kind of interesting. I want to see if there's any copper in them. I would I would suspect there is copper in these. There's got to be copper in these. And they're only held in there by glue, so I'm just going to try to pull them out. Wow, this is really interesting. <laughs> okay then. So this is the bottom or the back half of the uh, pet containment system there. Nothing but plastic, so I'm gonna put that along over here with the uh, other plastic. So we've got these four rings 
and there is copper coming out of them. So I'm wondering just how much copper there could potentially be in these. And it looks like a decent amount. I'm going to find a razor here and I'm going to cut the tape and I'm going to see if there's any possible way that I can take the tape off and show you just how much copper is on there. Because I'm, I'm curious myself, guys. I'm curious to see just how much copper is in some of these spools. Look at that. Look at that. and gentlemen we've reached the end of our micro scrapping journey and here's the bounty ladies and gentlemen look at that copper spool oh my goodness it's certainly a sight to behold lovely lovely we've got some junk wire here as well as a mid-grade board because there is gold flashing components on there so i'm going to classify that as a mid-grade board along with a lower end grade board. We've got the screws that came with it. Remember, no metal left behind on the Gill Skills channel. And we've also got three decent sized extruded aluminum pieces, along with all the plastic that came along with this pet containment system. And there you have it. If you like what you've seen here, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And until the next time, have yourself a scrap happy day.